Hey, so uh, I'm excited to be back today and I have something to share with you that I think you're gonna like. I know I like it, I'm super excited. Um, so stick with me and uh, check out this new piece of equipment that's gonna make a big difference. So welcome to TWC Projects. Um, if you're new to this channel, uh, I like to create things, fix things, uh, and enjoy God's creation outside. I got a little bit of a surprise, something I've been working on for quite a while, and finally it's happened. Um, but before I share that with you, um, let me kind of tell you a little bit more background, especially if you're new to the channel. Um, I have a 21 acre piece of property out in the woods that I'm building uh, a retirement home, and, and that's the goal. So, but right now, it is, uh, you know, started with just forest and I've taken a lot of the trees down and I've got a lot of trees and junk to clean up. But um, if you've been watching along, you've seen how I've been working uh, uh, a view from up here where the house is going to reside right in here in the middle. And it's going to look down across that beautiful um, uh, scenic view of the, the brook down there and the hillside up the other side. And so we've been cleaning out some of the woods as well and onto the other side while I've been waiting to get the thing that I'm going to show you in just a minute to help me get all this stuff out of here. Um, some of it I might be able to burn, but I'm planning, not planning on doing that just because it's so windy up here all the time. Um, so you know if you've been watching, you saw I built a, 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 a little roadway down into the woods and to create as a dump, a landfill, I guess for all the stuff that I couldn't use. Um, any of the bigger uh, lumber, any of the bigger logs that I could save for lumber I did, um, the rest are gonna end up going um, back to mother nature. But, um, so of course the excavator has been fantastic. That's helped me uh, take down trees and clear and, and move earth around as I've needed to. But I got something I'm gonna show you in just a second that's gonna help us get all this stuff out of here, hopefully. Hopefully if it isn't too muddy today, I can get down in here with it. So um, let's go take a look at it. All right. All right. So you ready? Here it is. <laughs> it's a beast. It's a 2007 GMC 7500 um, dump truck. And it's in really good shape. Uh, has quite a lot of miles, well over 200,000 miles on it. But it's got a, a big old... Uh, V8 diesel um, with an Allison transmission in it and had to bring it up through the mountains last night. It was a bit of a rough ride, but uh, it, it did all right. And uh, it, it needs probably some love, but we've got it uh, ready to go today. So hopefully it um, starts up and runs well. The batteries uh, hadn't been turned off properly when I went to pick it up, so they were dead, but we jumped it and it didn't stall all the way home two hours driving through the mountains uh, but let's see if I can show you oh, get around the back here too sorry I should have pulled it out first before I started to do this video I was just too excited and I wanted to kind of show you what we got here so the back looks pretty good it's got a obviously I can tailgate with it a chain set up on it and it's in real nice shape fairly new tires uh, the thing had, uh, I think they have maybe 10,000 miles on the tires and same with the brakes, uh, new brakes on it. No leaks that I could see anywhere. Uh, all the fluids look good in it and, uh, it's running pretty well. So we're going to put this thing to work today, but, uh, I thought I'd just do a short video first, kind of showing you, um, what we've got to work with. Uh, I don't know if it's going to do what I need to, or I don't know if I'm going to be able to use it right away because I realized that the trail I originally cut down through um, out this way towards the dump area, I cut wide enough for a tractor, not for a 26,000 pound GVWR dump truck. So uh, we'll see what happens, but uh, I may have to bring the excavator up here and widen that little path a little bit more but um anyway i thought i'd do a reveal for you tell you a little bit of, again the background about why i got it what i'm doing up here why i've gotten this equipment um, i'm on a one-man mission 
won't always be one man. I'll hopefully have help on other things, especially when I start the building process itself. But right now it's just, you know, creating the land the way I want it and uh, learning and having fun and enjoying uh, God's amazing creation outside. It is just, I love it when the sun's shining like today. It makes it so much more joyful, but uh, being up here anytime is great. Just, it's, it's so quiet and beautiful. Just the wind and the birds and uh, my noisy equipment sometimes, but it's all right. So thanks for joining me. I uh, hope you like this quick video. Uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe, hit the like, um, uh, hit the, the bell to get notified when new ones come out. And uh, I'll have a few more of these uh, right behind. You'll see the truck in action and uh, some, some more of the work I'm doing up here. So uh, have a fantastic day, a fantastic week, and I will see you very soon on the next project.